the winds are changing slowly but surely. Mm -hmm. Uh, and I've, I've noticed what you're saying too. Like when I talk to MFA friends or other people at MFA is like the grumbling that used to be very quiet a couple of years ago mm -hmm. is becoming more prominent where they're like, you know, I'm really not a political writer. I never yeah. really cared about this kind of stuff. I'm just going to keep doing my thing. Uh, but then in, there is an incentive, right. To keep doing that. Like when you see like the best selling writers, what are they doing? Well, they're still doing political stuff, at least poetry stuff. And it's because I think because of social media, it's kind of, taken over everything there's this there's a political backdrop to everything on social media you know like like when you're posting something online it can be attacked but in a, from a political angle it, on either side really and you see people do this in bad faith on both of these both sides i think and, yeah uh, but it, there is like an incentive to be like how political can you be you know can you use this kind of historical relativism to uh you know beat your opponent over the head with it kind of stuff yeah i i think there is a shifting wind so i think you're right that there's the, the trend over the last eight years you know it's been eight years so of course it's changing you know it's coming yeah. to a different headwinds and something's changing and there's a co couple cool writers that are doing cool shit that isn't political you know isn't political at all yeah and we needed that. I think we needed a few artists to be like, hey, you know, you don't have to follow these rules. Like you can do whatever you want 